I am strolling along the King's Highway and or in 1813 it would have been known as the Great Road from Philadelphia to Sunbury. In 1813, stagecoach would have taken 18 hours to get from Philly. To here in Orangeburg. And of course, bringing some mail with them. And of course, I always do like the memorials. Dedicated to those men and women who went forth from Orangeburg and the surrounding area to faithfully serve in the armed forces of their country during times of war and peace. We mourn for those who never returned. Erected by Joseph W. Morrison, BFW Post 2198. Thank you, Joseph Morrison. Across the way, the inn is one of the last old hotels. The way I understand, there were uh, three other ones on, the, on these corners. Here, here, over and here. This marks the site of the first courthouse erected in Schuylkill County at Orangeburg, Pennsylvania in 1815. The courthouse served the county for 36 years until 1851 when it was moved to Pottsville. And of course, one of the reasons why is because coal had become king and Coal had the power, but there it was. Behind me is the bell taken from the courthouse. You've seen a picture of it. Well, here it is. They have kept it, restored it, and put in a small park here. This park was the home of the Ortho Theater. Well, it's been a great uh, uh, challenge here at Orgsburg. Been down here three or four times taking pictures and videos, and it has been fabulous to be able to do this. I have taken some pictures of some of the uh, buildings that I thought were maybe a little bit older. And they are probably not unlike any other small town historic buildings. But what's important here is not the building itself, but the people that lived in it. And the people in uh, Orangeburg throughout the years, even in the 17, in 1800s, into the 1900s were very civic minded, very community minded. It had been written that the uh, people who lived in Augsburg were more intelligent than, than others, and I believe the writer might have meant that they were more community-minded and they got involved into their community. 
uh, much more than the surrounding areas. And it even shows today that uh, Orisburg has always been a, uh, uh, a civic and, and, and get involved into the community and have different affairs going on. And that is another reason why if I was to move, I would choose Orisburg for, for my home. Uh, thank you for uh, going along with me. It has been a pleasure to do so. Come down and visit and uh, remember, my channel doesn't tell the whole story. It only gives you uh, just a little bit of what, what's going on. And uh, uh, quiet John out and about. Come on down, get involved, get, do some history. Thank you for watching.